So here's a fun but simple example of attacking with the king. So black is actually down a knight for a pawn, but by playing king b3, we're immediately threatening queen c2 mate because the knight on e1 is pinned. Now, they can actually pin us with rook e3 or queen e3, but it doesn't matter because we can decoy the pinning piece and checkmate them. So when we go king to b3, let's say they go queen e3, I will go take, take, and queen c2 is mate. And if they play rook e3, it's exactly the same thing. Rook e3, take, take, mate. And the only way they can really prolong the game is by playing this. It really only prolongs the game by one more move, so it doesn't make any difference. Decoy the rook, and there we go with queen c2 mate. So really nice example of how if our king can be safe deep in the opponent's camp, we might actually be able to use it to try to directly checkmate them. So... When you're the attacking side, pay attention to when you have that opportunity, and as the defender, watch out for a safe king in your camp.